Hey guys, welcome back to some more Vitamin Y. So today is Wednesday. These we're using Ubel XCs. So I actually made just a tiny tweak to the deck. Not not much. It's a little tweak. So uh, I decided to go ahead and take out Gale. Uh, Gale really wasn't putting in that much work, and it was it was doing less work as the tuner than being the work that it could put in as a non-tuner. Uh, you guys probably don't understand what I meant by that, but uh, pretty much it just wasn't really bringing anything new to the table. So I decided to go ahead and replace it with a card that has a little bit of synergy with uh, Bridge Dragons, also a Dark, um, and uh, hopefully will be pretty helpful, especially since I'm only running one, so the chance of me drawing are pretty high, and if I draw it, it might actually serve a little bit of purpose up in here. Okay, well I didn't draw it, I drew a lot of other cards that are running one, 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 but uh, well, hopefully we can pull off some interesting plays. And if you guys are wondering what the hell the card, the hell I'm talking about, because you probably can't think of it, it's actually Spirit Reaper. Uh, you know, Spare Reaper, you know, I can, he, he won't be destroyed, he, I can sit on him if my hand is shitty, and then of course I can always go, uh, same, I know what you meant, what, I, I, I don't know what you're talking about, I don't know what you're talking about, <laughs> um, then of course you can go, uh, the Burge Dragon, run into that Spare Reaper and make a Black Rose, if need be, but I accidentally made a mistake and now I'm actually starting to realize what I made and the mistake that I'm, I realized that I just made is that probably one of the best plays um, that I want to do with this deck is to have you bell in the field and go, you know, have terror on the field and go debris, debris back, summon back the spear reaper and then level eater, you level off you and, and go for um, start a spark and then I'll have the spark terror combo. I took out spark. <laughs> I, I, I just, I literally just did it like right before it and I just realized the combo like right now. I'm just like, fuck, why'd I do that? Anyway. Uh, we should be okay. So, hands pretty good, pretty good. What? What are you saying? Oh, uh, low four. Like what? I used I summoned Dark Grapher. I discarded Dark. I sent to Dark. I didn't special summon it. What about it? Yes. What's wrong with discarding level eater? What's wrong with discarding level eater? Not special summoning, that was my normal summon. What's wrong what's your problem, man? What's your problem? <laughs> yes. That's what I'm discarding. You got a fucking problem with that? No, I didn't special summon Gruffer. That was my normal. <sighs> sure. Okay, that's fine. Techno it. That's fine. So special summon Techno it. Tribute, cast know it, summon something else, summon something from your deck. Over and over and over and over. I do this deck a lot more lately. I've been doing this deck a lot. Things that involve her heroics. You know, some people, when they're bad, like predictions, are like, oh, put the heroics, you'll back up to three. Why? That's the, some things that I just don't understand. You're real one dragon type and add one another no, no, monster. No, 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 no. Okay, that's fine. That's a, that's a weird neg. Alright, what is that, six? I think it was six. I didn't really get to see it for that long. I didn't even get to see long enough to actually look at the card. I think it was six. Kind of kind of looked at it real quick. I was going to do for five, six, 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 six. I have to confirm. You kind of just like that. Look at it. Like, huh? <laughs> Did you blink? Did you miss it? Oh, it's too bad then. <laughs> that's exactly how the situation is right now. So, right now, it's not too terrible. If he kills my, uh... Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Reveal the... Other... Wait. Stop, 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 stop. Stop. Nigga! Really? Oh 
like really like god like hold on let me see that other card let me see that other card because i thought it, i saw a level six and then i saw you at a level five so what show we gonna watch yeah? mom shut up <laughs> <laughs> the fuck so loud i bet you can hear her Okay, and the one you searched, so that's six, and what did you search for? Because the one you searched for looked like level five. Uh, yeah, you revealed a level six and search for five. That's five. One, two, three, four, five. No, I said it's five. One, two, three, four, five. I think I can count. I hope I can count. I said it's five. Can you not count? I mean, most of the time when it comes to, you should have revealed the card to me before you put that back, because now I don't know if that's what you put back. I know, usually I say read nigga read, because usually people can't read when it comes to it, but I, counting up to six? Oh my god! Please, the, all the humanity counting up to six! Damn! First graders, man, <laughs> the first, first grade struggles, counting up to six! <laughs> you can get another, uh, test new it. That's fine. Seriously, I have no idea what the fuck you're sending back because you need to, you should reveal to me before sending shit back to your dad. But it's cool. It's cool. It's fine. It's not, but it's fine. So you're going to, it's not an effect that activates like that. Just go ahead. Yeah, it's fine. Mm hmm. Okay, Tef Nude Effect, Tef Effect, go ahead and summon a normal dragon monster from your deck, is it going to be a 6, is it going to be your egg, isn't your egg a Gemini, I think it's a Gemini, so I think you can, no, big, really big egg, what level is that, 8, yeah, it's 8, yeah, 8, Summon one heroic monster from your hand. Okay. Another egg. Alright, well. I'm gonna get Felgrand. That's nice. Yep, here we go. Unless he wants to go for Heliopolis, but I doubt it. It's probably Felgrand. XC. You don't need to state that you're Xing. <laughs> Just XC. Xing doesn't start a chain. All right, Heliopolis, sure. Man, dude, you're overextending like a son of a bitch. You should've went for Felgrin. Heliopolis is nice and all, but you should've went for Felgrin. So what, you're gonna use Heliopolis in, in Tribute 2? Okay, okay. Okay. So how many are you tributing? Minimum one. From side of field hands and destroy equal number of cards in the field. Tribute Sue. Okay. Target. I'm trying to think about mistiming. I'm trying to think. Uh, hold on. So, Zack Pop. I will chain, limit reverse, summon you bell. Chain resolve backward, destroy, destroy. Effect, effect. Yeah. I'll chain. So, this would, if that would be summoned, then we both die. I get my effect, you get your effect. So, I will chain to your effect. 
because these stars have to obtain after the resolution of Heliopolis, so I don't miss. So that's good. So I'm gonna go ahead and I gotta wait for him to summon his shit before I can summon my shit. Oh, Terra's at the bottom. That's surprising. I'm surprised I didn't draw right into that bitch. I was gonna draw him Spirit Reaper. Okay. I don't mind Spirit Reaper. We just need to bridge dragon. What do you summon? Did you summon? Okay, you did. You did. You summoned your blue eyes. That's fine. Alright, so now I'll summon Terra. I was waiting for you to. Because. Well, actually, I'm summoned first. Yep. Okay. Okay. Like I said, you burnt up so many resources this turn. It's gonna be very difficult for you to deal with my terror with such low card amount, but you don't really have to worry about me right now. I'm not planning on doing anything spectacular. Nah. Kill my grapher? Sure, I'll take the 13. I'll take the drill slow. I need to, I need to build up my resources while wiping his field. Draw. Oh, never mind. I have plays. I have plays. I can actually go for some interesting stuff, actually. Some interesting stuff. I can go for... I can go for Gerda. I can go for almost everybody, really. Yeah. And go message in the bottle, summon you guys back. Because you're all different levels, of course. Uh, then I can activate Galaxy Queen's Light, and I can make you guys all 10. And then I can go ahead and Xe and to. I wish I could use Level Eater, but I can't, because I can't special summon anything else the turn that I use the effect, so. I might wait on Heartland, because Heartland does seem kind of trolly ish, but I'm just not completely sure, so I'll take the duel a little bit slower than. I normally would, so I'll go ahead and use level eater effect. I'm gonna start eating off of tear until tear is nice and juicy, like a prime steak. Nice and juicy and ready to be exceeded with. Effect. Like I said, you're gonna you're gonna be down on resources anyway, so I'm cool. So terror's now level ten. Uh, the possibilities are pretty endless right now. I'm just trying to think what the fuck I want to go into. I could probably stall out all the way until I get down to 8, actually, if I don't draw into the right cards. Stall out all the way until I get down to 8, and then I can make everybody 8, and then make a Felgren. And then I can have Felgren on the field, because, you know, I'll show you that Felgren might be the correct choice. Why is he back? Why did you summon your monsters back? Why? What, what? What miraculously brings your monsters back to the field? No, my end phase. The, during your end phase, as in my end phase. <laughs> no, I just copy and pasted the effect. So it is my hidden face. <laughs> no, 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 no. You wish. You freaking wish. Actually, that'd be worse for you if Terra was during your end phase. Just wipe your shit and then fucking summon something and poke you, you know? At least you had the opportunity to go ahead and defend yourself. Like, no, that, that'd be even worse. That'd be even scarier. What does he do? I just have something from your hand, but banishing three dragon type normal monsters. On the turn, you can banish one dragon type monster in your hand and target one card in front of strike target. Okay. I'm going to get to banish one. A mirror of graveyard to target one card in front of strike. That's cool. Sure, go ahead. That 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 makes my plays much, much easier. Much, much easier. Fact. Thank you. Thank you. I'm sitting here trying to figure out. I'm gonna play around terror now. I can just fucking just have ultimate nightmare. I don't give, I don't give a fuck. The effect is only once per turn. Don't gotta worry about that. I am just totally chill right now. Next turn, I can just activate message in a bottle, summon everybody back, 
activate Galaxy Queen's light, go for super chocolate fudge covered or whatever the hell I want to go into really. Almost. Almost. It has to be. What banished not grave sir your first no Maggie Bell went to the graveyard. You're just trying to find loopholes and shit and flaws in my plays, but I'm dueling perfectly fine, sir. No. You good you worry about your own plays, I'll worry about mine. You gotta worry about how you how you're gonna get out of this situation with this ultimate nightmare, because this ultimate nightmare is gonna eat you. I didn't even know this was a erotic card. I've never, I've never seen this. Heretic? Erotic? Cause I don't want to. I don't know because you don't want to say like heraldic because that's a totally, heraldics are totally different. That it says heretics, right? I think that's how it's pronounced. Yeah, seems about right. Lots of people say that. You got no way around it. And next turn's gonna go into attack mode and eat you. <laughs> I really don't like this card. It really doesn't have any synergy with the deck. You just summon it as a beater and popper. That's really what it seems. All it seems like it does. It doesn't really have any synergy. Galaxy Wizard. Oh, I can I can go for Felgren. Yeah, I can activate. Message in a bottle. Summon everybody back. Summon Galaxy Wizard. Galaxy Wizard activate your effect. Become level eight. Uh, activate Galaxy Queen's Light. Make everybody eight. XC. And then I can still have you bell on the field, which of course its effect will be negated and it'll be in defense mode. It'll take up a lot of my resources, but it seems like a pretty chill idea. You know, then I can have Ultimate Nightmare Interfell Ground. So hold on, not. So I'll summon you. I'll summon you. I'll summon you. Alright. So I cannot test my emotions. Exceeds during this turn. Alright. So I'm gonna normal summon you, because I have a normal summon this turn. Uh do I have to I don't have to go into Felgren. I don't have to use my Galaxy Queen's light right now. No, I'm not gonna use it. I'm not gonna use it. I'll go for King of Fairlone. Yeah. So King of Fairlone. XC into King of Fairlone. In fact, I'll go ahead and detach, and I will go ahead and get me a Mass Chameleon, because Mass Chameleons are awesome. You can go ahead and go into attack mode. Ultimate Nightmare attack and eat your Sutek, to Suteka, Suteka, Fact. you and your monsters attack, and you are Eight and twenty-three, and I did not take my four thousand because I did exceed this turn. Then I still have my Galaxy Queen's Light I can use for later. Damn, if only I had a little bit more. Actually, I could have. I could have, but nah. It's okay. Got activated Galaxy Queen's Light, made everybody ten, and then made these two into a Gustav Max and shot him once. But it wouldn't have been enough. If I if I if I did enough damage to reduce his life points under two thousand, I would have done that play, but. Cool. I'll take it slow. I'm up on resources. I have seven to his two, so I'm chill with it. Yeah. I got a scary terror. I mean, ultimate on the field, and I got Ubel. Uh, six. Six. <laughs> nope. Five. Okay. I was thinking about calling five, but it's cool. It's cool. <coughs> okay. Now what? You're gonna like tribute it? You gonna tribute your thing? Or what's up?
Beginning of your one hand, I want to accept this card from your hand or your side of the other target unlock. Okay, so if he has this, he can destroy Ultimate Nightmare if he wants to. I don't, I don't care. I do not care. I don't need Ultimate Nightmare to beat you right now. <sighs> Come on, man. Do something. Making this video last a lot longer. I want to get a couple of duels in here, but this video is literally just going to be one duel. One duel. Who are you attacking? Sure. Uh, uh, I can summon Heartland, but nah. Ah, actually, yeah, I can. I can. I can normal summon you. Level Eater Effect. Get level off of you. Summon you back. Now this Queen's Light. All nine. Now we will finally have the powerful Ubel next to the new age Ubel. Heart. <coughs> ah, so good. Of course, I'm going to get my effect, so let me go ahead and. I mean, not a mask him, especially since, you know, I'll be having Phantom of Chaos. Well, I won't be having Phantom of Chaos in the actually, because it's in C material, but um, this duel is over. Still is not. So, Heartland Attack. You take your attack, but, okay. Let's say you're not destroyed. And there we go. That's your book scenes. At, at sometimes at its finest. So that was really good. Good job, you Bucksies. Proud of you. Got a good hand and went off with some nice plays. Alright, so I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of I'm and Why. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with Cosmic Email. Thanks for watching.